Hello, good morning. Today, we're gonna be doing a day in the life. I don't actually think I've ever done one of these and I'm sorry if it's a little echoey in here. We're in the bathroom. I woke up around 9.30, laid in bed for like 30 minutes. Finally, I'm making myself get up. I thought I would take you guys along my day today as I like go to campus and just what I get to after campus, whatever I'm doing today, I thought I would take you guys along. So my class is at noon. It's computer graphics one. I am a graphic design major for computer graphics. It starts at 12, but on Tuesday, today's Thursday. On Tuesday, we learned a really complicated lesson, to be honest. It was all new to us. There were so many steps. We got a little confused. And we have to be at a certain point before class today. So I'm going in like an hour early just to make sure I'm fully caught up, fully understand what we're doing. The lab is open, so I was like, I need to get in there like an hour early. Pretty much done, but there's some things I need to tweak and I just kind of want to like be prepared because um, we're following a video. So I just kind of want to watch that video. It is 10 o'clock now and I need to like wash my face, brush my teeth get myself put together and my hair it's a little greasy today to be honest um it's not looking the cutest not looking the freshest and i think what i'm gonna do is like two braids into ponytails never done that before it's so basic but um usually my lately my go-to is just like a braid on the side but i just feel like it needs a little bit more help today and i don't have any dry shampoo i really need to get some first we need to go ahead and just wash our face moisturize and get this ready face wash in the shower because they usually wash my face in the shower i find myself washing my face more often if i am in the shower usually i skip this step to be honest in the morning but since i'm filming i think i should do it so not that i'm doing it for the video i mean i am but like I just need to do it. Cleanser. It's a fulvic acid brightening cleanser. I've used it twice, <laughs> but I actually really do like it. So I got this at Sephora. So we're going to use this. My moisturizer is just a so Sephora nourishing. I don't really know if the front camera focuses, to be honest. I have this cute little headband to wash my face. Mm. I look like fourth grade me. Anybody else go through a headband phase where you wear a headband just like this? my skin has been so like that's such a plus i have a problem with staying on top of my skincare and like taking care of myself when i'm just sitting at home which is like all we did in 2020 and this year is like my first time going on a campus so i have been keeping up with like my skin a lot more oh my gosh my mustache we gotta get rid of her and i don't want her here so Goodbye. Ow, that was my lip. Do you guys ever like clean your little razor afterwards and you're like, ew. Now for the only step in my makeup routine <clears throat> is Gimme Brow by Benefit. Okay, story. I cannot do foundation. I even tried on Halloween. Um, I was a dead Snow White while passing out candy and I tried to like do a foundation and they just got so, they got 10 times redder than this, my cheeks. And every time I just try foundation, it just never works. So, but eyebrows, different story. Here's what they look like now. And then these just give them a little bit more of a zhuzh. Fills them in a little bit. 
All right, and that's as much as I do. I I love mascara, but I feel like, can you guys give me some tricks and tips? Because every time I do mascara, I'll like curl my lashes, but then over like the rest of the day, they go straight and I can't keep them curled. Horrible at strip lashes. Lashes? Lashes. Here's my trick of the day. If your hair, ugh, it looks so much worse on camera. I swear it's not that bad. Um, if your hair is starting to feel a little dirty, a little greasy, don't brush up here and brush down. No, no. If you got some tangles, only brush here down. I promise you don't want to brush the top of your scalp. It'll make your hair look 10 times worse. That one even look good. It just looks, it just looks not good. How do girls do it? <laughs> I'm about to get frustrated. I'm gonna try a different pony. You know what? We're going with a little scrunchy. I hate it. And back in middle school, I would film like hair tutorials and all this cute stuff. And like, I lost everything. Every skill. I literally got sweaty from that. <laughs> so much stress. How stupid does it look? Let's go ask. The boyfriend. Opinion on the hair. Does it look stupid? Is it like too big? Okay. Um, the hair looks cuter in here, so we're gonna go with it. And let's pick top first and then decide if we're gonna wear it with jeans or leggings. To the closet. How cold is it? Cold? Yeah. 58. 58? Yeah. Oh my lord. For reference, I live in Florida. 50 is cold as heck. Nothing sounds good. The struggle. You know what? Maybe we can go relaxed and cute. This is like a fun oversized sweater. Maybe I can do this with some leggings but which leggings do we do a slight pattern or would that pattern clash with this pattern what do we think mm, i think that's gonna clash i think we need i think we need to go solid leggings we're gonna go solid full legging we're not gonna do crop we're gonna do a full legging and i am gonna be sitting on a computer for two and a half hours so i need something to be comfortable to sit so every outfit i put on Gordon Campus, I always do the sit test because that's what I'm going to be doing most of the class anyways. And I just have one class today, so it's go on campus for one class for two and a half hours and then come home. So I'm going to go ahead and change into this and I'll see you in a second. And we're dressed. I just added my Apple Watch, which I've been horrible at wearing. This ring I wear every single day and never lose my hand. This little necklace, um, these both are from Icing, and I've been trying to accessorize more, and this is like my go-to staple, so I'll show you guys what it looks like in the mirror. So here's what we're working with. I rolled up the sleeves because they go all the way past my hands, and it just kind of looks not good, so this is what we're working with. I think the little rolled up sleeve action is pretty cute, and then we're just wearing leggings. I rolled it up a little bit at the ankles sorry my mirror is so dusty i don't even have time right now we need to pack uh my bag and get ready okay so right before i run out the door i need to um upload this video i actually film and edit for my boyfriend's family's youtube channel so this needs to go up while i'm in class so i have this set it's gonna be uploading all while i'm in class hopefully this will be done sometimes it takes forever so like i have to get it up now it says two hours it'll probably take five <laughs> That's just how slow our internet is.
Okay, I just stepped in from going to Publix. I went to Publix right after class and I just had to get a couple like lunches or easy meals for the next few days because we don't really have anything until we go major grocery shopping. Mikey got some sweet tea and then I got Diet Sunkiss and then he got Coke and then we got our cat some treats because he's been out for like two weeks and he's been begging for them. So my friend actually messaged me about these and she's like you need to try them and I actually saw her having them and I was like are they good and she's like oh my god you need to get them. So they only sell them at Publix so I had to go there and get them but they're like these little veggie hot pockets so it's broccoli, potato and cheddar and then spinach, artichoke and parmesan. And I only eat chicken, so only me I eat. So I can't really eat Hot Pockets. And Hot Pockets just seem like such an easy lunch. So the fact that they came out with a veggie version of a Hot Pocket, I'm so excited. So I got those. And there's four total. So that's like four lunches or four dinners or whatever. And then I also just got some veggie mac and cheese. If you guys haven't had... The bird's eye veggie pastas you should really try them they taste exactly like normal pasta but you get a whole serving of veggies and i'm not a huge veggie eater so the fact that i can make these taste delicious is such a win for me so i got that and i am done with class that was so long and frustrating i literally worked the whole i was i got there at 11 and i left at three so i was there for a whole four hours just really focused on getting my project done because it's due tonight and i actually have to go and upload it i didn't even turn it in in class so i need to do that but before i do that i have to finish the finishing touches on the video that i was uploading earlier today um for mikey's family's youtube channel if you guys want to watch it i'll link it down below but i need to go do finishing touches up on that and what's the plan for today just hanging out we're just hanging out here's the cat say hi leo he doesn't like be held very much at all. <laughs> He's purring though. Don't let him fool you. I'm going to put these up and then quite opposite of what I just got, which is like all veggies and really nice stuff. I'm going to eat a couple pieces of leftover pizza because we got pizza yesterday and I need to eat. So I'm going to just heat up a quick like slice of pizza to hold me over until we have a really nice dinner, which I don't know we're going to have yet. I'm craving Waffle House. What about you? It'd be fun. Oh, I just ate my pizza and I forgot I got a package. So I'm going to open it. I never like order anything, but I got a mouse for my computer. Um, I ordered white. I hope it's white. It looks like it's black, but this is a dupe for the yeah, it's white. This is a dupe for the Apple mouse. I really wanted the Apple mouse, but that thing is like $90. I'm not doing that. When this was 13 on Amazon and my cousin had this, I literally thought she had an Apple mouse and she's like, "No, girl. It comes with this to recharge it. It's rechargeable." And oh my god. Here it is. It's so sleek. It's so nice. Oh my god, I have the hiccups. Sleek and nice. That was what I got. The reason I ended up getting a mouse is because doing my homework on the computer using Illustrator and Photoshop, it's really hard to do with the trackpad. I've done it, but it's just harder. So having a mouse is going to make my life like 10 times easier. So I'm so happy I got that. And it was like $13 on Amazon. I'll link it down below. Okay, and it's been several hours since I was in this spot and that cabinet's open. So after we left here, we went and hung out at his uncle's house for a little while, just kind of visited. It's really cold. <sighs> it's really cold, so I had to like put on another sweater. Then we decided just to grab some dinner on the way home and we just got Zaxby's because we were watching some YouTube video and it had chicken in it and we were like, mm. We really want chicken. Okay, he wants now. Anyway, so we just got some Zaxby's and I think I'm just gonna go ahead and end this vlog here. You guys got the whole day of me 
starting waking up this morning getting ready and then going on to campus and doing my schoolwork and all of that if you guys enjoyed this please give it a thumbs up comment down below if you would like any more day in the lives or days on campus or anything like that i can surely do that for you guys yeah give this a thumbs up comment down below don't forget to hit the subscribe button and i'll see you all in my next one bye Thank you.